Hello, my name's Ellen from the Christmas Decorators and today I'm going to show you how to make a Christmas garland just like this one here. The first thing you need to do when creating your Christmas garland is to measure your mantle to make sure that the garland cascades beautifully down either side. So before adding your lights, the next thing you need to do is you need to flatten out your garland, start shaping the branches to create a nice centre line. This will be a fantastic base to start adding your decorations onto. So when adding your battery lights to your garland, you must make sure that the battery pack is securely fastened to the back of the garland. I then wind the lights evenly through the branches. So after adding the lights, the next thing we want to do is add in the ribbon. Now the ribbon you can get from any haberdashery store. I've got two here and what I'm planning on doing is placing one on top of the other. I think this is a bit different and it really gives a wow factor to your garland. So what we're going to do to dress your garland, simply pinch together, starting at the end of the garland and wrap it round securely like so. We then, placing it on top of the other, pinch it like so, and bow over the top of the garland. So now we've added in the ribbon, the next thing we're gonna do is to put in the decorations, the fun bit. I'm gonna start with some natural decorations, but what we're gonna need to do to secure them into the garland is to get some floristry wire and wrap them around the pines, nice and tight, securing them there, which gives you a good point to secure them into the garland. And then I've got other things like oranges. We've just, these are dried, we've just pierced through, added on a bit of wire, and these are great. They really add a bit of colour and they smell fantastic. So as you can see, I've got my finished garland here. I've added loads of decorations. The natural ones, you can see, like the oranges, the cinnamon sticks. I've even added some lotus flowers here. We've then added some lovely berries, which really give the traditional sort of look. The best thing to do though, is to buy a garland and snip little bits off and add them in to your garland. I've also added some gold sparkly floral pieces. Again, buy them in bigger bits and snip them down and just add them in. I've then got some lovely little birds here, which just sit perfectly on top. You don't need many of them, just a few in the centre of your garland. I've then added baubles in groups of three with the floristry wire, and I've added some other lovely little trinkety little ornaments. 